Hello fellow mutants, welcome back to another video and we're going to discuss in this video an article by Screen Rant discussing like every track and new character in Mario Kart 8 Wave 5 booster that has yet to come out uh, but it was announced at like the Nintendo Direct I believe so let's uh, get this read shall we Mario Kart 8 uh, booster uh, Pass Wave 5 was announced at the June 2023 Nintendo Direct. Bring a new crop of characters and tracks on the game to the game. This is the fifth edition of the of Mario Kart expansions, each of which has featured a wealth of new content to keep the game fresh. The latest entry in the worldwide hit kart racer series is approaching its tenth year since release. Mario Kart sp 8 has been out for 10 years? Wow, okay. The latest entry in the worldwide uh, hit Kart Racer series is approaching its 10th year in release, so these booster course pass waves are useful to in preventing players player fatigue in the absence of a whole new game. As with series booster course pass updates in Mario Kart 8, Wave 5 brings back a group of series favorites from classic Mario games, along with a handful of new surprises. Players should look out for these characters and courses zooming into Mario Kart 8 sometime this summer. I have to say, I've been like a Mario Kart fan since the Wii e era. Um, been in love with the Mario Kart series since the Wii era. Um, I didn't have a Wii U. I wish I did. Even though I'm kind of like, I've been told I'm very lucky because there there were some issues with the Wii U. But like, it's, I guess it's insane with how like as like how big, like the game of Mario Kart this for sense costume with like all the levels and D, like characters, the D DLCs, uh had over recent years same thing with super uh super smash pros i like i'm just amazed just how much content that they put out in um those two games and i'm so happy like as long as you like pay for like the overall battle pass thing for uh mario kart you don't have to like pay for these like new races or tracks so when they decide to release it it already comes in the payment that you do so like like comes in the payment in general so I think that's wild anyways new track squeaky clean sprint the whimsical venue is the only new track announced at Mario Kart 8 booster chorus pass wave 5 meaning the others will likely be remastered from other Mario Kart games. Most like the older Waves editions, it shrinks the cast down to miniature size and transport them to an oversized bathroom to race around. Squeaky Clean Sprint features daring jumps over open <laughs> toilet poles, bars of soap as slippery obstacles, and the brief underwater splashes in a rapidly filling bath. The bathroom is adorned with a number of Mario themed products and decorations. Bottles of Princess Peace bubbler bath, rubber ducks with Mario hats, and blooper pran detergent. Can you imagine? Because I'm kind of stuck on this part. But the, um, the uh, toilet bowls. Daring jumps over toilet, open toilet bowls. Can you imagine how like dirty players will feel if they intentionally go in there with their knees and they piss on themselves? <laughs> oh, I might have to actually do that intentionally just to be a goofball. <laughs> the track hasn't even come like. Th this new wave hat, wave five hasn't even come out, and I'm re already enjoying this. <laughs> okay, okay. 
It could be just a relatively smaller size of the characters talking, but this looks like a sh short course. It could be a quicker trip around the track with more laps required, as other Mario Kart 8 courses have done before. Yeah, like how like with uh, Baby Park. Overviews of the whole track shows that it appears to have multiple levels with as many twists, turns, and jumps. The course may double back over itself across a variety of different elevated tiers. Some of these may even be a shortcut or alternative routes. Whatever the case, Squeaky Clean Sprints looks like an exciting track with a lot of sly references and in jokes for players to enjoy. <laughs> oh, I, uh, I'm going to enjoy this. And if this, now we're getting to this character, and if this character includes into Super Smash Bros. wasn't enough, the Piranha Plan is coming into Mario Kart as well, Woods. And now I kind of wonder <laughs> if you're the Piranha Plant character, if you can get that Piranha Plant um, uh, ability in the game, or if like the Piranha Plant, if you're the Piranha Plant character, if you're already going to like be biting people on your left and right, like you can't do when like you have that power up, so that would be very, very interesting. Betty, Patty Piranha will return to the track of Mario Kart 8's Booster Pack, uh, Booster Course Pass Wave 5. Patty P premiered in Mario Kart series with 2003 Mario Kart Double Dash for the GameCube. Man, I wish I had Mario Kart back on the GameCube game days, because I played Animal Crossing on the GameCube. I missed out. <laughs> uh, players could unlock him after completing the Star Cup, although now it's as single as buying the DLC. All racers have had partners in Double Dash, and the P Petty Pranos was King's Booze. Okay. The Dasheri duo could be seen drifting around aboard the Prana Pipes, a vehicle composed of green tubes. No word on whether they'll make it into a Mario Kart 8 yet. In the trailer, Prana Pete rides a generic green motorbike with Prana plant decals. Also, his Mario Kart debut was in Double Dash. PD actually originates from the, the earlier game, Super Mario Sunshine. Peter Piranha is one of the first bosses players will encounter in the game. He appears in the first mission of Binaco Hills, the first area unlocked. Players fight him directly. In Dawn of the PD Piranha, he spreads he spreads muck around the area and can be handled handily defeated once the player shoots water into his mouth with fluid and then ground him ground pounds his stomach three times. Since water seems to be his weakness, PD Piranha may not fare too well in Mario Kart's eight squeaky clean sprint track. Sorry, it took me a little while to read the end, but like, wow, okay. I'm just taking that in. Like, now I wonder what would happen if Prana Pete. Goes into a mass that has a water world. Now I gotta try it just to see. Probably gonna lose. But I have to say this once. Anyways. Another character that's coming in is the Wiggler. The form worn Wiggler will also wiggle his way into Mario Kart 8. With the release of the Booster Course Pack Wave 5. First playable in Mario Kart 7. For the Nintendo 3DS, Wiggler has been making cameo appearances in Mario Kart series for 
longer for far longer. Players had to dodge a regular shaped bus, long double dash mushroom city and mushroom bridge courses. He also appeared in a late game boss in Mario Kart DS where he his frustration would get the better of him as he races as the races went on. In Mario Kart 8, players can even control Wiggler aboard the Wiggler themed vehicle, the Wild Wiggler, a segmented yellow ATV. Uh, Wiggler first appeared in Super Mario World from the, for the S S N E S, released in 1990. There, they presented a unique obstacle to the player. Since they couldn't be beaten with Mario regular Mario's regular jumps, once attacked, they would only get madder, redder, and faster. Super Mario Odyssey introduced a new Wiggler variant, the Tropical Wiggler, with bright colors and pink hats. In that game, Mario could control Tropic Wiggler with Cappy. Using their segments to stretch out and cover more ground, with their need for speed and quickness to anger, Wiggler should fit right in when the Mario Kart booster course come course pass waves five launches. There we go. I don't know why it took me a bit to like read that. Um, then another new character. I feel like. It's like mostly new characters at this point, but um, I'm not complaining though. Kamek. Perhaps the most notorious Maggie Koopa Kamek will also make an appearance in Mario Kart 8 with the release of the Booster Course Pass Wave 5, although he wasn't playable until Mario Kart Tour. Kamek first appeared in the Mario Kart Super Circuit. This would this was his first handheld title in the Mario Kart series. Released for the Game Boy Advance in 2001. I missed it! I had a Game Boy Advance! I, like, back in the day I would like play, like, Lego Star Wars Original Trilogy. Um, the old three themed Ninja Turtles. Adventures of Jimmy Neutron, Very Odd Parents, Shrek! This Shrek Battle Royale! Like, I was, I had games like Kingdom Hearts Chain of Memories and Mario Kart on the Game Boy Advance. I, my life, would be complete. My ass would be happy. Now I'm disappointed. <laughs> now I'm very disappointed in myself. So, <laughs> wow, okay. Anyways. Kamek only plays a minor role in the game. In this game, he hangs out near the finish line of the Bowser's Castle track. In the trailer for his Mario Kart 8 debut, Kamek rides a purple scooter with yellow trim. In the larger Mario series, Kamek serves as a rival for Yoshi. Beginning with Yoshi's Island, he sought to remove. Uh, baby Mario and Luigi from Yoshi's custody in order to ensure they don't grow up to wreak havoc on the Koopa family. More recently, he appeared in Yoshi's wo uh, Woolly World and Yoshi's Craft World as a main antagonist alongside Baby Bowser. Now though, he'll go up, up against Yoshi for the Mushroom Cup when Mar Mario Kart 8 booster course Passway 5 releases. With all his new characters, with all the new characters coming to the Booster Passway 5, it'll be tough to decide which one to try first. With just one course this time around, however, players have the perfect stage to debut them on. Mario Kart 8's Booster Course Passway 5 will release sometime in the summer of 2023 a definite release date and more details will likely be coming soon see i feel like as much as we are getting like these characters we may like i think this 
fair to say or fair to say that the uh, the likelihood of there being at least one other course in this set is likely, because I can't see them only like releasing like squeaky clean spring as phonus that track looks. I can't see them only releasing one um track. At the very least, I can see them doing like two, and maybe like the what three characters that we got in here. One, two, yeah, three characters. I could be wrong, but I like I said I can't see them like not releasing like two maps at a time. But that's just me. What do you beautiful people have to say? Let me know in the comment section down below. I love you guys. Have a wonderful day. Be kind to one another. I will talk to you fellow mutants later.